In the midst of World War II, in the shadows of espionage and intrigue, one name stood out among all the spies and intelligence operatives, Richard Sorge. His story began in Germany during the turbulent years of the Weimar Republic. Little did anyone know that this enigmatic figure would go on to become the greatest spy of the Second World War. Richard Sorge was a master of deception, fluent in multiple languages and possessing a magnetic personality. He moved through the highest echelons of society effortlessly. But behind the facade of a journalist and playboy, he led a double life. He was a committed communist and a trusted agent of the Soviet Union's Red Army intelligence. Sorge's espionage career took a remarkable turn when he was dispatched to Shanghai, China. It was there that he established the now legendary Red Orchestra Spy Ring. Operating under the guise of a journalist and surrounded by an eclectic group of spies, Sorge embarked on an extraordinary mission. From his base in Japan, Sorge penetrated the highest levels of the Axis powers, Germany and Japan. His ability to gather crucial information was unparalleled. He relayed invaluable details about Hitler's plans to invade the Soviet Union, helping Stalin to prepare for the onslaught. Sorge's journey was fraught with danger and deception. He skillfully manipulated both the Nazis and the Japanese, using their rivalry to his advantage. He was able to gain the trust of German Ambassador Eugen Ott and Japanese spymaster Lieutenant Colonel Kenji Hatanaka. In the fateful summer of 1941, Sorge sent a chilling warning to Moscow. Operation Barbarossa, the German invasion of the Soviet Union, was imminent. At first, Stalin was skeptical, but Sorge's credibility prevailed. His warning allowed the Soviets to brace for the attack that would have otherwise caught them completely off guard. As the net tightened around him, Sorge's cover was compromised. In October 1941, he was arrested by the Japanese authorities. Even in the face of torture and interrogation, he never revealed his true identity as a Soviet spy. Sorge's loyalty to the cause was unwavering. Richard Sorge paid the ultimate price for his espionage efforts. In November 1944, he was executed by hanging in Sugamo prison in Tokyo. But his legacy lived on. Sorge's contributions to the Soviet victory in World War II were immeasurable, and he is remembered as one of the greatest spies in history. As the dust of history settles, Richard Sorge's story serves as a testament to the incredible sacrifices made by intelligence operatives during World War II. In the world of espionage, he was a true master, a man who navigated the treacherous waters of deceit and danger to alter the course of history itself.